Hey everyone, this is Jeff from Metal Guy Reacts, back to bring you another reaction video. Today I'm super stoked to circle back to Pentatonix. Uh, today I am checking out Pentatonix doing Evolution of Michael Jackson. Now, even though I'm a metal fan, I've always been a big fan of Michael Jackson uh, f uh, musically for a number of reasons. I mean, he, as a pop star, sort of defined what a pop star is. Um, he's also one of the very few artists out there that I have heard uh, sound engineers talk about where there was so much power in his voice that they usually didn't have to do some of the stuff they normally had to do uh, for other people to make their voices sound thicker. Like, they didn't quite have to do as much layering or as much process processing on his voice uh, even way back in you know obviously in the 80s and stuff uh, when he was kind of at his pop prime um, you know doing all that stuff they just they didn't have to do as much and Thriller is obviously one of the best albums of all time everyone that worked on that was just phenomenal and the list just goes on and on I mean Vincent Price was on that Eddie Van Halen was on that Quincy Jones was on that Michael Jackson was on that I mean the list just goes on and on so uh, I'm excited to see what Pentatonix is going to do with this if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do that real quick I'm going to be dropping more Pentatonix videos coming up and let's check this out this is uh Pentatonix doing evolution of Michael Jackson oh baby give me one more chance come on girl I know I'm stopping it only about 20 seconds in I am never going to get used to Avi's voice, like the bass that came into this. I mean, everybody is just doing insane stuff right now, but Avi's low notes just, I like, I'm, I'm never prepared for it. It's the same with like mid, I could say it about everybody, but I just, that caught me really off guard. So I'm going to back up here and start this over and try not to get weird about how amazingly low and awesome his voice is. Come on, girl. When I had you to myself, I didn't want you around. But that pretty face is always made you stand out. I want you back. Oh, baby, give me one more chance to show you that I love you. I am going to try to make it through this video without pausing too much. There is so much that just hap happened there. Scott, as always, came in with this amazingly soulful like voice. I just love the way he sounds. I, I'm speechless again. This is what keeps happening with Pentatonix videos. Is like you guys send them to me, and as I watch them, I just go. I, I literally could just go. Yeah, you know, Mitch did this, and and Scott did this. I did, you know, and just keep going. Kevin, did, you know, oh my God. Okay, okay, here we go. <laughs> And shout, shout, shake your body down to the ground. To the poor don't stop, don't stop till you get enough. To the poor don't stop, don't stop till you. I wanna rock with you, I'll rock with you all night. Dance you in the sunlight. Ooh, Billie Jean is my lover. Ooh, Billie Jean is my lover. Ooh, Billie Jean is my lover. So 
looking out yeah, across the nighttime. The city wings the sleep as I. If they say why, why? Tell them that it's human nature. Why, why? Cause this is real. This is unbelievable. And I mean, I'm going to have to talk about this at the end, but everybody is taking a different piece of what made Michael Jackson so good. Like in the coolest way, they're all using what's, yeah, this is, this is unbelievably good. I don't know if I'm showing how blown away I am by this performance. This is so good. I know it's just getting towards the end, but this is unbelievable. Everybody is just absolutely killing this. Just absolutely killing this. What's up, you guys? Thank you so much for watching this video. I know we haven't posted a video in a while, but it's because we have been working so hard on our... Okay, Avi just said hey in a register that was just ridiculous. I have so many thoughts, and this video has melted my brain like so many of their videos do. Everybody brought something, and... You know, I don't want to get repetitive in my videos. I end up just going down the line every single time and talking about every member and what they brought to the table because it's so hard not to address each member and what they what they bring. So I'm gonna at least address some. So obviously everybody killed it. The entire group killed it in one way or another. But I wanted to emphasize that I think what was cool is they divided up the songs in a way where everybody could take a piece of what MJ had and, and and exemplify that so say like oh god 
I'm just, this is so hard. Uh, you know, Mitch soared through the clouds as usual. And actually, I would be willing to bet that his range is actually higher than Michael's was. But Michael, I mean, I, he had an unbelievable range and power at every part. God, and then... Ugh. Kevin came in for some amazing stuff. They all just absolutely brought it. And that was, I think, the coolest thing is, like I said again, is that they kind of split up different things. So, you know, um, uh, you know, Mitch got those high parts. Uh, Avi came in with crazy, crazy low parts. Scott, again, he tends to just bring this unbelievable soul to everything that I really, really love about his voice. Like he just has this soul. And one of the coolest things about MJ is that at any part of his range, he had this unbelievable soul. Like he could infuse such feeling and emotion at his low, at his high and in his mids. They did so many tracks in here that I absolutely love. Uh, Man in the Mirror is a phenomenal tune. I did voice plays version of that, which was unbelievable. I would love to hear Pentatonix do every single one of these as a cover. So I say that in a lot of their tunes. And again, I'm just gonna have to be a broken record because they keep blowing me away with everything they do. They just keep bringing it. These people are just at the top of their game, just absolutely killing it. Man, I am just blown away. My, you know, I always think of stuff later too. So I'm trying to think of like what else was going on there. They also did one of my other favorite tracks. I think it's called Will You Be There? Um, they did a phenomenal job with that. The harmonies were just gorgeous. And uh, one of my favorite copies of that is actually by the band Boyce Avenue. Uh, they did it like an acoustic cover of Will You Be There? And I would highly recommend checking it out. It's so good. Man, Pentatonix bring in as usual. I am jumping back into their stuff. I've got a short list going of uh, songs I'm going to react to of theirs. So if there's more you want me to react to, though, add it to the comments below. If you see one that uh, other people are suggesting, though, that you want to see, hit the thumbs up button. That just helps it climb to the top. Let's me know what most people want to see. And at the end of this video, so at the end of the video, I'll put a little card you can click on uh, to check out my playlist for Pentatonix so you can see what I've reacted to already. Um, but man, they blew me away as usual. This was unbelievable for them to be able to handle a lot of the stuff that Michael was doing is just crazy because he is one of the greats of all time. Thank you so much for checking out this video. If you have a moment, please subscribe. It helps the channel grow so much and I will catch you all in my next reaction video.